Okay, children. You asked for it, and you got it. Wild Wings 2 by... Fitchell. It's a game... Right now, we found Mog trapped behind some magic crystals. We have to find a way to get rid of them. I'm sure there will just be a switch that we just step on. And it'll go clickety. Oh, look at this dim room of unpleasantness. Angel feathers. Whoa, can we do it? Can Whoa, watch. Oh, look out, look out. Oh. Yeah, we sure showed those encounter events. events. Oh, the Crustapod. Let's fight the Crustapod. Let's show him who's boss. Oh, he's already doing zero damage. Well, how can I cancel his zero damage? What's it matter if I cast silence on him now? He's already... ...like that. What did I do that for? Shade Silver Wing. What a guy. He knows how to make it count. Shade Silver Wingsy came to town in a frenzy. Brave Shade Silver Wing. Darn. Okay, I've never actually just fought one of these things. It looks pretty horrible. He's got a... Oh, and Marina really kicks his ass. That's good. Let me see that big, wide-open mouth. You really think about how some people very much enjoy such mouths. That wasn't so hard. So I wonder if you get a non-standard game over or if you're killed by that thing. With a special... a special scene with hand-drawn animation. Oh, this looks like a puzzle. And what a puzzle it was. It's a butterfly. Oh, what? Oh. I made it green. Okay. But then what? Oh. I don't like these elementals. No. Oh, god damn it. So. Now I bet we have to touch a green butterfly. There it is. Oh no, all the butterflies are clustered together. And I can't even see them because they're behind the black. I touched the wrong one.
Now all the flames are out. And there was great sorrow. Oh great, not another weird puzzle. Well, I guess we know where that boulder is going. I guess we need a boulder on each switch. What'd that do? Oh. Bet you didn't know that there were people who could talk about cardboard boxes for 30 minutes. There are. pause one on each. Oh, I guess you only have to touch it with a rock. Do I lose it forever now? Have I failed? That's it, I quit. Okay, now we're gonna win it all in one, in one swoop, in one swift motion. Uh, I'm gonna win. Get ready for this. Get ready for this, Dan Brown. Bet you weren't expecting that twist. Oh shoot. Well, I just fucked up that rock. Maybe I can finish the puzzle with this rock. Welcome to the Breakout Artist Management Kickstarter campaign. Breakout Artist Management. I. Damn it! Okay. This time I'm gonna win. Do you want to hear about my drinking problem? Of course you do. I had one glass of Chardonnay today. Because I got four bottles. It's not my fault I have four bottles. Four separate people decided that it was the perfect Christmas gift. Wait a minute. Are these holes randomized? Where the hell did the 
go that time. What's it doing over here? I didn't ask for no rock to go over there. I guess it really makes you think. Now when I push it here... It's supposed to cause it to be able to be pushed onto the one in the middle. Unless that's what this hole actually does. Oh, that's counterintuitive. Thanks a lot, bat game. Win? I win! Oh, and that let Mog head out of there. Maybe we can go back and see him. And well, I guess the butterfly puzzle is reset. So where's the yellow butterfly? Is that the red one or the yellow one? I can't tell. Oh, there's the yellow one. Can those guys stop going behind the black? I got the wrong one. Look at that. Oh wait, no I didn't. Okay, now I have to not touch the group, the red one. I'd like it if the butterflies could avoid clustering together. That's the blue one. Green one is down there. Now they're both down there. Oh, and there's a, an enemy also. Okay. Well, uh... Shit. Where is... Where is the... Is it here? Oh! Okay, I'm just gonna fight these guys. I got to let off some stress. Oh. As usual, cinnamon buns are bad for you. But they're so delightful. I lose. Okay, now I'm gonna get the green guy. Yeah, I got him. Okay, and the blue guy's next, and the blue guy's right over here. Don't fuck this up, Shade Silverwing. And finally, I just find the red guy. There's literally no way to fuck this up, Shade, so don't you find a way. No, you'll totally find a way. Where the hell the red bastard go? Shit! There he is. don't like it.
Did I win? Hooray! I got another thing. Oh, I haven't even been out there to see Mog yet. Did I already go down the stairs that were over here? Oh yeah, that's where that puzzle was. Okay, so there's different stairs on the other side. special down. Oh! That was just a hunch. What do you think of that? I got the towel! I got the wings! So that's another go back and do everything task is buying diffusal kits and opening up all the trapped chests that are in previous areas. I'm probably not going to bother doing that. I'm just going to make sure I'm carrying diffusal kits from now on. So if there's some sort of puzzle or activity Open the last set of crystals, I guess it is elsewhere. I hate everything about video games. I just can't believe how much I hate video games. It's astonishing, even to me. It really is something. Video games are so bad. Sometimes I don't even know. put on his stupid thing already. Okay, from now on I have to kill the Crustapod first before he puts on his bullshit. But I think this gets rid of the bullshit. It seems to. I don't know why I did a regular attack with Sirocco, that was dumb. There's only one good video game in existence. And it is... Wild Wings 2. by Fitchell. You heard it here first. Has this guy already put on another shield? I don't even know. I don't even know. I guess he did. Aren't I silencing him? Does this stupid shield not count as a magic skill? die already.
Good, he died. I'm glad he's dead. Okay, where am I going now? Oh. A whole bunch of... Yeah, I did that. Me. Oh. So it runs out, does it? Ugh, how many other ones do I have to light in this area? To like that thing? Okay, this is an easy battle. So I can just take him down. Look at that, that's how you do it. Number one thing I hate about video games? That these days the market is entirely dominated by the complete... ...mindless morons. Okay, I'm gonna use some sap. First I wanna make sure there aren't even more torture torches. Don't care to fight these guys. But yeah, back during that that Halcyon era when games were actually made to be fun some losers played them to the point of exhaustion they put in how many hundreds of hours in the same game and then they demanded more content more content and because they were the loudest and the stupidest the game companies inevitably decided to cater to them and that's why we have all these complete shit games with procedurally generated content and random loot and they're not fun but the complete morons who make up the video game market will put in the 200 hours required to to game the RNG system and get you know a full set of rare whatever the fuck which you need in order to have any chance of actually completing the game as it is. In fact, there is no completing the game. There is no... final boss, final test of your prowess, followed by a resolution. That's not a thing anymore. Video games are now like... manga. In that they have to perpetually go on forever. You did it. You're the bat, Shade. The Batman. All right, settle down with that. Sorry. You didn't have much of a hard time out there, did you? Not really. It's all good. Let's see if we can find Cacti. There's actually something I need to discuss with you guys. Well, hey, I'll do anything for you at this rate. You just saved my sorry butt. Let's just keep an eye out for those damn fairies. 
Who knows what they'll get up to next? I think at this rate we might have impressed them by keeping on top of their game. Well, let's not hold our breath. Now what does the mission want us to do? Get out of the cave. We are escaping from the cave. A warper crystal, what the hell is that? is it? There it is. It greatly increases one's evasion. And it's an accessory. Hmm. That trade-off looks a little bit better. What's Life Bangle do? I don't know, have I seen any instant KO attacks? I think that trade-off is better, though. Hey, it's Clinch. I'm not sure how I landed myself here, but you're a lifesaver, Shade. You look like you're itching to get some goods. I'm glad those blasted fairies didn't grab anything. Okay, good. Now I can replenish. I can sell my silver vest. Oh, I have some stone orbs. How long have I had that? Oh yeah, and I also have slime food. Gotta remember to feed Buri pretty soon. Oh, I can sell the Howler Claw. Anything else that's just for selling? Oh, I guess not. Alright, let's just top up our... Our those. We still have so... I think we're good for items. We are... We are just fine for items. Maybe I'll start carrying 20 of these. 20 juicy mosquitoes and 20 juicy beetles. That is our new quota. Finished. I notice we have what looks like an elite boss monster behind those crystals. I wonder how you let it out. Would you ever want to? Oh, and there's Tau in here somewhere. Are you kidding? This map is huge. Gotta check every single space. Maybe I should just buy some more Ruridia Sap from Clinch. Why am I auto fighting? That was dumb. Someone hurry and fill up your bar so that I can escape. There, that's what I'm talking about. Oh great, now I'm stuck. Okay, how am I going to get out of this one? I'm going to use my last bit of sap. You might say I'm a bit of a sap. Gone over the loop, yes. Hey, it's a door. I suppose that door wasn't there before. Should I go back and get the towel right away? Maybe I will. Because you gotta be a completionist. Got a 100% the game. How 
long till this sap wears off. That's real. Oh. Okay, two of these guys are fine, I think. So 23, all that time. I haven't even talked about how much I hate anime and manga. I guess it's never really come up, has it? I guess I don't hate it. I just... Oh, I found it. Clickety. What the hell did that accomplish? I don't hate comics, I just, they... Whoa! It let out that guy! LOL! LOL! Did I mention the funny joke? Have I called attention to how funny the joke is? It is, it is very funny. Almost too funny. So the joke is that Firewing, which is, guys, we were just attacked by a book. It sure seems like it's shady, but I think we've fought weirder things by now. Well, it dropped this random key. Do you think it opens any of the doors down here? I'm not sure. It has a very strange but pretty design. I say put it off for now. If we find the door it goes into, then great. But I have a feeling that book wasn't really meant to be here. Well, whichever door it goes into, hopefully we'll find it one day. Okay, I think that's telling us that the door isn't actually in this dungeon, so we might as well... Might as well just move on. Now, back to explaining the joke. You see... In the firing book, 
the super sad ending where Shade dies. Yes, really. He actually kills himself. And it's really rather pointless and contrived. But by the third book in the series, logic has all... This guy doesn't even have Viridia Sap. Well, screw him. Logic has... And realism has been kicked right out the window by the third book. The first Fire Ring book was kind of informed by real bats and sort of uh, a study of of how they live and stuff like that. By the third book, it's just mumbo jumbo. They basically go to bat hell and fight bat Satan. So, the entire story is completely contrived to begin with. And at the end, just for some contrived sadness, Shade has to give his life. So he kills himself. And this did not sit well with... Mishka, wait. Let's stop here for a bit. What's wrong? Well, why are we walking around anyway? It's not wise to just stand around out here. It makes you an easy target. Let's just stop for a moment. I need to think things through. I mean, it's been so long since I've seen you, or at least it feels that way. I'm just finding it hard to remember the times we've had together. Yes, unfortunately. What about you? Do you remember anything? I do. I remember everything. We were separated when we were very young, of course. But I remember it like it was just the day before. Treehaven was not perfect, and it did not have a perfect leader. Granted, it is too much to ask for perfection. The only reason you can't remember a thing from back then could only allude to one cause. Frida. Frida? Dick, what we did back then, it wasn't right, and I know that, but what she did afterwards was unforgivable. What are they talking about? Should I know this? Mishka, spill it out! What did she do? What did we do? We were forbidden to gaze at the sun. You know this, yes? That's actually still in effect. Mm? I suppose I've lost track of that. It's been a while, but the freedom was so sweet, and I started to forget the rules. You're saying we looked at the sun? Yeah. It was a dumb little dare, but we did it. Unluckily for us, owls caught us playing this game. They could have torn us apart right then and there. But Shade Silverwing's mother actually rescued us. So did Frida. No, that's a lie. Ariel tried to rescue us both, but there was no remaining hope for me. She wanted to rescue me too, but Frida, she told her off. I could have died, but I suppose I'm dead to them. Mishka, how could I have just forgotten all this? Well, it's not your fault, really. After all, somebody had a part to play in that. Frida tried to reason with those damn birds. She let them have me to appease them and to save her own hide. After that, I was just history to them. I served as an example, no doubt. Surprisingly enough, I still did not perish. The Machinators saved me from their talons. The Machinators? So that's why you're a part of them. And it's funny, because that is when my life took a turn for the better. Sure, they turned me into a cold-blooded killer, but I could not resist their embrace. They promised me power and saw the skills I carried in me. They saw the potential in me. Skills? You already had a taste of it back at Paradise. You remember what you saw? 
Imagine seeing things like that every single time you want to sleep. They wanted to help me control this strange power, but even today I have failed to do so. Mishka, I wish I knew. Ignorance is bliss, Dick, but there are some things that can't remain covered for very long. And I want our colony to see that. Frida is a coward and will not fight for her people. I don't understand. Haven't you figured out how you forgot about the incident already? Frida made you forget. The trauma was too much for you to handle. She also did not want to risk setting off your rage so early. Like me, you were still young and did not have a full grasp of your power. She caused you to forget about me, Dick. Your own sister. Can you imagine how devastated I was? Watching you in the distance, not having a care in the world. Mishka. I'm sorry that it has taken me so long to come out to you. I became more and more detached as time passed. My world became all I knew, and eventually it all turned into what seemed like a vivid dream, or a nightmare more appropriately. I focused so much on enhancing my powers, the exposure to all that hatred and pain swelling up turned me bitter. And that's why I must make her pay. I understand. Good. Will you join me then? I'm not sure where to go from here, but when we find Frida, we'll confront her. It's best that you do the confronting first. I can't let her notice me right away. Who knows what she'll pull off if that happens. Right. What do you think? Dick! He's over here, guys. Hey, Dick! Whoa! It's you again. Wait, who is that? What perfect timing. Just when I thought we were getting somewhere. Dick, did she hurt you at all? No, Shade, she didn't. I want you guys to cool it, okay? She is my sister. Whew! What the hell? She is? We're in the middle of something. Shove off, why don't you? Dick! Back at the Cobalt Guild, this lunatic took you over and used you to fight us. You gave me no choice, bird brain. The power was already unstable. I was merely trying to get Dick to see. You aren't making any sense. I know now that she's your sis and all, Dick, but I'll have to side with the runt here. That chick is bonkers. We aren't going to let you harm him again. Shade, don't. Your arrogance is annoying. I think I will teach you all a lesson. My brother and I have a plan, and we don't need you saps tearing all of it apart. Come on, then. He's sticking with us, and there's nothing you can do about it. I will use my skills. Why not cut your agility? Mm. Temporarily increasing all stats. Maybe Marina could use that this time around. Yay! Does she still need turbulence, though? Your puny minds cannot comprehend what is at stake, even after everything you've been through thus far. What are you on about? We know exactly what's going on. Goth wants to use the ring again, but he also needs something else. And that is what we're after. You may have an understanding of his ulterior motives, but what you don't know is that those close to you are not as trustworthy as they seem. As I have said before, my brother and I have a plan. I've longed for this moment for every waking day since I was abandoned. Abandoned? Who are you aside from being Dick's sister? Uh, hello? She's the psycho woman from the Guild Shade. What utter disrespect. I am the silver wing you all forgot about under Frida's wing. So ignorant and adamant. She has really kept you all in the dark, hasn't she? I don't blame her, honestly. The entire colony would have turned on her if they knew her history. 
Yes. Wait, what did you mean by that? Frida is hiding something? Well, we sort of figured by now. She is pathetic, just like the rest of you, for leaving a fellow bet to the claws of those horrible, savage beasts. I don't even recall anything about you. And that is the point I am trying to make. Frida may have blinded you all, but that does not make you any less ignorant and despicable. Okay, I guess I wasted the... the buff item. Stop! Stop fighting right now! There will be peace! Dick, your friends want to ruin our plan. No, Mishka. Look, this is going too far, okay? What do you mean? You aren't actually going to give up on me, are you? No, I never said that. Just listen for a moment. I don't want to leave my friends behind, all right? Don't think that I don't care about you, because that's wrong. We will keep looking for Frida, and I promise you we'll confront her. I won't let go of that. Excuse me? What about Frida? Uh, Shade, Frida needs to be stopped. What do you mean? What is she doing? She... Ah, it's not about what she is doing, it's about what she already did! I had forgotten about my sister for what seems like an eternity because Frida went ahead and made me forget. I don't get it. Why would she do that? Mishka and I gazed at the sun when we were newborns. Frida gave Mishka up to the owls to save herself from repercussions. That and there's something about her. I don't know. I think she may be up to something. Why do you think she disappeared so suddenly? I won't deny she's up to something. Shade? No, Dick is making sense here. I've always had it in my mind that this whole thing was too fishy. Right! I mean, I don't know what exactly it is she's doing, but I feel it's nothing good. Either way, Shade, Mishka and I want to confront her if we ever do encounter her again. I can't believe she did this to me, did this to my sister. All right. We'll see to it she explains this whole thing. I have a lot of respect for Frida for what she has done for me. Let's not jump into this too hastily. Fine. Mishka, does this sound good to you? Whatever. All right, good. Thank you. Have either of you seen a walking, talking cactus with an orange cape around those parts? Whoa, that's a non sequitur question. No, I haven't, but I see that Mog is with you. You darn tootin' I'm with you! I'm sorry to interrupt, but we have to find my, ahem, buddy. Crap, I forgot to mention anything about Phoenix. He went missing too! Oh, uh, right. But he disappeared even before Cacti went up and abandoned me. Ah, uh, why is everything so messed up? Well, we'll see if we can find him around here, but we shouldn't stay for too long. I saw the cactus you are referring to. You did? He should still be not too far from here up north. Do you even know what these two really are? Maybe I do. Very well. I suppose I can trust you to make the best decision, then. Uh, Shade? What is she talking about? Don't worry about it. Let's just find Cacti and Quick before those fairies get us again. Ah, you're right. Damn those fairies to hell! Mishka, are you... I'll be fine on my own. I'm sorry I can't come with you. I really wish I could, but I can't just abandon my friends like this. Hmph. <sighs> Don't worry about it. I have things I need to take care of anyhow. Don't let me stop you, but don't forget about me. Never again. Dick? You gonna come with us? Of course. Let's go and find our cactus friend. Dick has rejoined the party. Your party received 50 fixed eps.
What's the mission say? Dick's back in the team! Let's go and find Cacti now. He should be up north somewhere. Well, you know what they say. That's another story.